I've learned a lot about epilepsy with living with my boyfriend and um, it differs from anxieties like with me I have anxieties where I get really fearful and I, I shake and I scream that I'm scared but when I see Ron have his seizures like I did um, a couple months ago with him, he was staring off to space and really rigid. And um, when we were on the platform, I had to call 911 because I know you're not supposed to move anybody who's having a seizure. And I also know you're not supposed to shake them or try to bring them out of it because they bring themselves out of it. And um, I also learned that Immune system disorders can cause seizures, like autoimmune with hypothyroidism can cause it, and infections. And um, also, I've had dystonia, spasmodic torticollis, where my neck went to the left. And that's a lot different big, than with epilepsy because with that, um, you do shake and tremor, but it's a movement disorder, and um, it's where your body is stiff and you shake and tremor, but it's different from epilepsy because um, with epilepsy, it's basically more with the brain than the movement and stuff, and um, with living with my boyfriend, it's just... It's interesting, and um, it's just I've learned a lot about it, and I like to learn, keep learning more about it, and I feel with dystonia, we should get more word out about that, too.